Come on. Don't even play like you wouldn't smash that to your face. Come on now. Put it up in ya. Get it up in ya. It's a mock bangers promo. We've all seen it on a channel before. It's a mock bangers promo. Bruh. They never send me it fully sauced. All right, y'all, what's good with y'all? Y'all really truly know what it is. It's your pizza champion, the king of Pizza Hut, the best pizza eater on the internet. I'll back at it once and again. And I'm not gonna lie, last night I went on live and I got fadoed. And at this age, when you get fadoed, what you have to do is mix yourself a new one in the morning to feel good, right? You get to an age where you need a little hair to dog a, you know, last night's calling, last night's toxicity to retoxify your system currently to make you feel a little better. So we did that. Is that straight vodka? It might be. Oh my goodness gracious me. Anyways, I guess that's... That can't be straight vodka. If it is, I don't know. I don't want to know it. But before we do anything more, we must pour a little bit of bubble. And then we live our best lives. Oh. Well, that's tough. All right. So as y'all already know, I'm the best pizza eater on the internet. And today we got the Pizza Hut extra cheese light sauce with the pepperoni west. And we got the honey barbecue chicken bites. Check that out. Easy. And so we got to go in for a bite. That's all that's left to do is we need to smash this za 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 za. And we have the dip from Pizza Hut as well. This is the ranch. Mm. Though it's still hot, no cheese pull today. That's unfortunate. But it is what it is, and we do what we do. Now, there's a subscriber of mine. Who said in the comments recently, bruh, what happened to the pepperoncinis? <laughs> Don't think I lost you. I still got you on the pepperons. It's just that I moved. It was COVID season. And your guy just ran out. I hadn't restocked. I hadn't replenished. But don't think. For even one second of your life or mine, that I wasn't going to hit you with a boneless bite and a pepperoncini at some point. Come on now. Mm. Look at that. So clutch. The best, most perfect sauce for wings at Pizza Hut is 100% the honey barbecue. Okay. 
Speaking of barbecue, this is barbecue. It's a home blend. And we're gonna douse a slice early. And we're gonna put a little Franks on it, a little hot sizzity zouse. But beyond that, we're gonna hit it with that dip. And you're gonna get a good look at it. And you're gonna go full craver. If you're one of these people out in the universe, and I know you exist, who say, oh, Pizza Hut, it ain't really got it like that. What do you mean? What do you mean? Look at this carnival dough. Look at the cheese. Look at these discs of pepperoni. Made by the gods themselves. In terms of crispiness. Brubra, guy guy, my homie. I have no idea. Who it is you're referencing? Or what you're even talking about? Way too fantastic. Come on. And as we start to feel lightly sober, we say to you, last night ain't over. Yes, <laughs> that's strong. Yes, I'm not talented. I write songs. Go to the link in the bio, my guy. -o. I got three down there for you. On my music. Sure, I ain't Prince. I don't exist with the best of them, but I'm pretty good. Check me out, my guy. That said, though, for real, that was a toaster last night. And last night I went live. And of course, as per going live on any platform, I'm drinking. I had drinks. Many. And I got to spill my guts. I got to talk real shit. Which is amazing. So thank you all for being there. 
I'm being supportive in that. I don't personally love to therapy session on the people who want to come and ask me questions. And I want to answer all your questions. But sometimes your questions lead to a therapy session. And you should take pride in that. If your question was that good and I and I went off for like 20 minutes about it, it means it was a good ass question. <clears throat> but it was a gangster piece. Perfect trifecta. I really appreciate those lives, man. When you're able just to connect with your people who, who follow you and have that notification bell on, they're deep. And you get linked in together. And you're able to just to go off and have a deeper connectivity point. I love that shit. I will say that's a hard point with me in lives is like, on one hand, I want to answer questions and entertain and be like that. We, on the other hand, because I don't get to express what I want to express in these videos on YouTube, I can weirdly do it on live. Right? And just pop off. But then it's like I'm ignoring the chat. So I always, I always battle with that. But I do at the end of the day always love everything that comes of those. It just feels like such an intimate, like understanding, kind of like therapy session for me, but also hashing of the details of like what you guys want to know, right? These little abrasive edges that you're like sanding down by me answering these questions that you have that you can't get to me on a regular basis. And so in those moments, I'm able to kind of shave those down for you. I don't know. <clears throat> Certain lives kind of go bad sometimes. They just don't feel that good. And then certain lives just go like the right people were in there. I had the right energy. And it becomes like this magic, this magical time that you can never recreate. And or duplicate. Which is dope. That said though. I'm crushed. I cannot finish anymore. I'll save these for later. 
I'll definitely eat them later. Absolutely. I'll never lie about that because a couple drinks, maybe a nap, wake up, smash two and two, be having a good life. So hope you guys enjoyed that one. Till the next one, you know what to do. Eat good, live well, and stay tuned.